so this channel is no longer going to be doing CAD works. No, not really. Uh, but I do want to talk about other software, so please stay tuned. So I know most of my focus on my channel has been around CADWorks and how to use it and we're not going away from that. We've got some great content coming up uh, for uh, CADWorks, but I want to start looking at other 3D softwares out there and one in particular I think is going to be eating CADWorks' lunch uh, and it really has uh, lately and that's uh, AutoCAD Plan 3D. Uh, now. Uh, Plan 3D has some, uh, in my mind, some shortcomings. Uh, it kind of forces you into the database system. Um, and, uh, you know, it, its modeling software is not as refined. The back end of it, the spec editor, is, in my mind, extremely horrid. I hate working with it. Uh, but, you know it does have some really good points and I think you know some of those points are cost Autodesk is basically giving the software away for free uh, to uh, anyone that uses AutoCAD um, and that's a really good uh, price point I mean uh, owners owner operators are going to look at it because it's cheap it, it you know you're already paying for AutoCAD you might as well have the 3d software with it with inside of Plan 3D, you get um, PNID, uh, so you can have intelligent PNIDs. You can have the process piping software, which ties to the PNID database, um, and you've got um, you know your structural steel so software. Um, you know where AutoCAD really shines, besides the price, is it's Orthogen um, creation, it's ortho creation software is very, very good. Um, the uh, ISO generation software is very refined uh, as far as the ISOs that come out of it. And rightfully so, because it's their own software, so you would think it would be tailored for, uh, you know, Plan 3D, where Isogen uh that cadworks uses uh it, it it's used by other software pdms pds auto plan i mean it, it has to be generic enough to be used you can modify it for that software and the the manufacturers of those softwares have really done a good job of it but it is still uh generic the isos that come out of plan 3d to me do look a lot better Another thing that Plan 3D has over CADWorks is the integration with inside of BIM 360 and be able to work remote in almost a seamless manner. Uh, you load everything up to uh, Plan 3 uh, BIM 360. Sorry, you load up everything to BIM 360, and anyone you give access to to the project can load up a project with inside of collaboration and be able to work on it. It does all the checking in, the checking out, uh, locking the files, syncing everything. Um, there is still some little bugs with inside the syncing software of BIM 360 and Plan 3D, uh, but overall I, I would give it you know a, a solid A uh, on the ability. Now, unless CADWorks really does some major changing as far as its pricing structure, I think they're going to really start beating themselves out of the market. I still think it's a much better software. The The spec editor is so much better. The piping design software is so much better. Um, and it, you know, works seamlessly. You can tell that Plan 3D was built by a programmer and very little piping has been put into the mindset or put into the software. Um, and you can tell that CADWorks was designed by a piping designer. Uh, it was originally designed by CoAid, which was a bunch of piping designers, you know, that put the software together and it worked very well. And then when Intergraph came in and bought them, 
they really stepped up the game on the software side of it and call you know really kind of brought it up into a more modern software um, but it comes at a price I mean CADWorks is right around ten thousand dollars a seat uh, for a yearly I mean for for just plant 3d and if you want to add in um, you know the P9D portion uh, then you're looking at another I think three or four thousand dollars on that and by the time you add in the ma yearly maintenance fee and everything that they they charge you're looking at sixteen thousand dollars for one seat to get started uh, and and you know that they're pushing BricsCAD, which is their software for CAD. I mean for AutoCAD, and it's a decent software, uh, but it's not. It's to me, it's not up to par because you've got to buy other software tools, plugins in order to do some of the fa fun, uh, basic functionality of AutoCAD. Um, and I haven't tried their latest version of BricsCAD in the last I don't know uh, year, uh, but you know one of those things was auto uh, uh, point clouds recap files. You could not bring in a recap file natively into BricsCAD. You had to get a third-party software like um, you know Qubit or uh, another software to read the the. Um, point cloud uh, AutoCAD has baked that in since 2015 and it works pretty well um, I don't like how it attaches the file to the you know the file instead of doing an overlay but you know that's you know at least you can work with it uh, another problem that CADWorks has is um, you know importing uh, step files you know sometimes you get a step file from a vendor or manufacturer of a valve or a pump or something like that and to import that into BricsCAD you've got to go and buy another third-party software to do that import for you um, again so by the time you're you know buying all the third-party softwares you're, you're not really saving a lot and you're you, you're buying you know you have to manage those you have to manage the license you got to manage the, you know who has it loaded you know and just it's not it's not a good thing uh, so if you go with AutoCAD you've got to pay your your sixteen thousand dollars for your license and then you've got to pay um, another you know fifteen hundred dollars a year for for the subscription fee for AutoCAD but if you're already paying fifteen or seventeen hundred dollars I don't know what it is I haven't looked in the last uh, you know couple months you're still looking at you know why am I buying another software when I can buy AutoCAD and they'll give me plan 3d for free and so hexagon is going to have to change its its structure its pricing structure if they want to keep um, clients uh, I already know several clients um, you know whether they're engineering companies or uh, owner operators they are already you know transitioning from CADWorks over to Plant 3D uh, because of the cost and um, it, it, it's sad because I still think that CADWorks is a much better software um, so anyway that's my diatribe uh, over the differences between CADWorks and Plan 3D and uh, in the next video we're actually going to get into um, you know setting up a project with inside of uh, Plan 3D and kind of look at some of its its functionalities